Hello guys, today we are disassembling and changing uh, thermal pads and paste on this um, uh, GPU number one, that's power color uh, Red Dragon uh, 5700 XT uh, These are the hash rates and temperatures, so memory is 100 degrees at around 70% fan and uh, core is uh, 56 i hope to get core down to 50 and memory to at least 90 degrees with the change of uh, thermal paste and pads so let's move to the hardware part disassembly uh, this is the card as you can see it's a uh, power color uh, the chip chip version has uh, copper pipes uh, and it looks um, it looks okay. Uh, let's see how much we can improve the, the cooling with the uh, new pads. Uh, again, we are using gill, these ones, for the pads. And for the um, paste is Arctic M5. So let's disassemble the card. Uh, so we need to remove the these screws that are holding the radiator and these two and of course remove the void sticker warranty so now we don't have warranty anymore but uh, I think this one is out of warranty anyway and uh, okay let's unscrew all of them All four of this and these two, six in total. They all have a spring on them. It's coming off. this screw and uh, unplug the vents after a little trouble the screwdriver is off so this is what we have we have eight uh, pads for the memory uh, here this is the thermal paste on the on the GPU and as you, you can see uh, there is a lot of oil which is not good we need to clean all of that and then we have one strip of pads here I think they're all 1.5 millimeters I can check that Sadly, the battery on my caliper is out, so I have to measure manually. Yeah, they seem to be 1.5, the ones going on the memory, and the other one. Oh, this is so bad. The other one seems to be... one millimeter so one and 1.5 now let's remove all of this and clean the both the radiator and the, the memory chips These pads are really bad. This should have been changed a long time ago. Actually, I think they're bad by default. So. 
and there's not much you can do about it. And because I used the screwdriver to remove the pads, I left a little scratch marks here. So instead of using screwdriver, use this plastic thing. Way better. Don't be like me. Let's clean it here. So much oil. Let's apply paste for Make sure that you screw these screws evenly, so don't like screw one to the max and then the other, but all of them just a little bit and then go around like this. And it's done. Let's uh, let's test it out. So here we are uh, at the same fan rate. We have 84 on the memory and 61 on the GPU. Uh, 84. We had uh, 100 before, so this is like 15, 16 degrees less on the memory, which is good. That was the the whole goal. And uh, the GPU is actually a few degrees warmer. And that could be due to using 1.5 millimeter instead of one uh, on the pads on the side. Or um, the radiator is now warmer because it dissipates heat more from the memory. So 
the GPU gets a few degrees more, but uh, that is not important in this case. Uh, what is important is to lower the memory temperature and uh, we got 15 degrees less here. So thank you guys. If you like the video, please uh, like, share, subscribe and um, see you next time. Bye bye.